Hi Leo, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and let's do a energy check-in for the end of September. Leo, these are general collective readings, will not resonate with each and every one of you. So take what works for you, okay? Leave the rest. So let's begin here. Dear God, Goddesses, Angels, Spirit Guides, please bless this reading for Leo and send them the messages they need to hear the most at this time. Thank you. So Leo, thank you all my subscribers. Welcome back. Welcome back. Thank you so much for all your love. And if you're new here, we welcome you in to our Omkara family. We meet here weekly for all zodiac signs. Join us. Subscribe to the channel. We welcome you in. And let me explain this, uh, the newbies. I'm putting down two sets of cards. One for you, one for the person who you're dealing with. And in the center, I have your mutual energy. Waiting for your ships to come in, Leo. Somebody is. Somebody is waiting patiently to see what goodies are coming for them now. So before I open your cards, Leo, I'm going to take an angel blessing card to top this reading. So my angels, guides, what do you have for Leo now as a blessing or an advice? Ooh, okay, that was, that jumped out pretty big. Uh, dealing with some emotions, uh, very deep emotions, Leo. This is uh, not just feeling happy or sad. This is like really going within and shedding light to all those inner demons, inner thoughts. Uh, you know, those feelings that you bury deep within, going through a very emotional time could be. So let's put this uh, with my angel here and see how it's going to resonate with the rest of our reading. So the first uh, card I have here for Leo... Uh, Person A. Okay, newbies, I mean, I'll be calling this person A and person B. So you decide which side you resonate best with, right? And go, don't go, go by the gender either. If there is a king of, uh, sorry, an emperor that I'm showing you, doesn't mean it's a man, okay? means somebody who's well in control of their life or wants to take charge, wants to take control. So this could be a female. And uh, yeah, that's it. So there is an emperor here for side A. Uh, trying to make a choice with the lover's card. Page of Cups, Nine of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, and the Ten of Swords. For Person B, Leo, I have the Five of Cups, Five of Wands, Four of Wands, Queen of Wands, Three of Swords and the Knight of Pentacles. Something is coming to a major end here, Leo, in a relationship, it seems. There is, uh, yeah, no wonder deep emotions. So let's start with person A, Leo. I have the Emperor here, somebody who is uh, wanting to take charge of some decision that's getting made. Not com really coming forward with anything new. Uh, things have really stag stagnated, things have really slowed down, almost to a place where there is no love or no more, nothing to be said anymore. It's almost like the page of cups is in reverse, which means there's nothing really left to say, except maybe now kind of heal the situation by bringing some balance back, you know, to life. Uh, it's made one person here f feeling very single, but all right, they are, they are okay on their own. This person is uh, abundant. They have their money intact. They are moving on to a fresh new beginning for themselves. They are kind, they are nurturing, they are sweet. They are very, very single now. Looking forward to a fresh new beginning, Leo. After th something has come to a complete halt here. Something has totally finished maybe with a previous relationship and now you know it's time to heal and there is no more fight left anymore for this previous thing you know whatever has been done is now totally over and out it's now time for fresh beginnings with the ace of pentacles here what's the ten of swords for it what's the ten of swords for leo oh my god uh, ten of pe uh, Swords is clarified by the Ten of Swords, Leo. This is a complete, completing a, an old chapter completely. 
like it's like you can't even there is there is no movement here there's no breath left it's like totally over but that's really not that bad here at least for person a i see it's it, this is a conscious choice being made in control of one's emotions i think here that i want to heal my life here i i know i want to have a fresh new beginning i don't want to fight for this connection anymore and i have everything that i need now to take care of myself and lead a happy healthy life going ahead let's see person b person b here is in deep regret uh, leo i don't know whether this side is you or this side is you but person b is uh, right now still in deep regret uh, seeing everything that's been you know happened and then the five of cups energy which means you know looking at all the things which didn't pan out uh, all the fighting all the wish fulfillment which never really happened because of this fighting that happened and uh, person a b is in deep regret for all this right they are they are feeling really really bad nostalgic about things that that have that didn't happen what's this uh, five of wands spirit what was this fight five of wands they had a lot of love for uh, person a so whatever said and done the person b did have a lot of love love for person uh, person b did have a lot lot of love for person a that's how they feel they wanted to have stability with person a yes they they also saw person a as a queen of um pentacles and person a is also seeing themselves as the same the queen of pentacles the person you know perfect spouse the perfect wife who looks after people who's nurturing loving kind has uh, a lot to give and yet looks after herself and this person is also kind of in deep regret maybe for what is passing or has passed and all the fighting which was unnecessary for a one spirit and the queen of pentacles for person b they are not feeling the love left anymore person b i think here is the masculine uh, energy they are not feeling the love anymore they feeling you know the foundation of their uh, stability has been rocked now yeah this person is in deep regret sorrow can't sleep at night worrying stressed out feeling terrible about the things the way they've happened but person a i think has taken charge of their life and made a conscious decision that hey i need healing i need to be on my own and i can't deal with this anymore person b is now regretting whatever has not happened i mean did which didn't happen properly in this relationship uh they are also in the three of swords energy i think trying to now recover from this heartbreak okay recover from this heartbreak even though they know that things have now come to a complete halt they are acknowledging that as well three of swords spirit yeah see when i said complete halt first card tuck it came out and it was a chariot in reverse things have totally ended here there is no they they are they are realizing that it's not making them feel very happy or very good this person is very sad Uh, I'm feeling heavy just doing the reading for them. Uh, Knight of uh, Pentacles, spirit. Yeah, they they know they know some mischief happened in this relationship, and there is no point even talking about it anymore. It's over. It's out. It's uh, come to a stagnancy now. Yeah, this person is uh, Leo. This is your card. That you could be on person B side. Uh, you feel that you know you've lost all your strength now. You. this is just a phase leo if this is you don't worry about it you know when things end maybe it was meant to be okay like i always say soulmates come to your reason for a reason season lifetime don't you know be in this energy for too long you're a lion you're a lioness you can't be weak okay get yourself out of your emotions no wonder these deep emotions were showing up starting of our reading this is a very emotional time for both of you here you the person is feeling as miserable right uh, tense words in the back is not the easiest thing to endure 
Let's see your mutual energies now. Uh, Leo. I'm sorry, I just need a minute here. This is a heavy reading. I'm sorry for you, Leo, if you're going through this. So, Spirit, what is our uh, mutual energy here? Yeah, Ten of Pentacles in reverse. This is the end of a committed relationship. It's the end of a committed relationship. Sun, okay, Sun is here. It's going to eventually make both of you very happy. Yeah, and the, and the King of Pentacles. So, Spirit, what is this uh, Ten of Pentacles? Ten, Ten of Pentacles is clarified by the Ten of Pentacles. What can I say to you, Leo? What do I say here? Except that this uh, fa stable foundation is in jeopardy. And that's, I think, the way both of you are seeing this because uh, it's a mutual energy. So what's this sun card? One bright, happy sun card. This again, Leo, is your card. Maybe uh, one or one of you has tried to have some communication with the other to try and you know negotiate something new or try and bring some balance back and have some happiness. But I don't think the other person has accepted. Uh, there's been a bit of a rejection maybe on to starting something new. King of Pentacles spirit. King of Pentacles. Yes, uh, Leo, this uh, King of Pentacles is representing stability in your foundation, right? Like I said, this, this is, don't go by the pictures on the card. It's the card's character. Here the card represents stability and foundation. So what's happened is a tower moment has hit this stability, which is leading you both to go on to now fresh new beginnings for yourselves separately. I hope this reading is not for all of you, Leo. Uh, but somebody here needed this reading, I guess. And if you need a private reading, you can reach out to me. We can, you know, see your individual uh, energy. But until then, love and light. Take care. Namaste. And stay strong, Leo. You are a lion. You are a lioness.